and Power version 1.10. Now you can record a sound on a button. In this video, you will learn how to add a sound to a button in Empower software on the Accent device. The example shown is Unity 36 Sequence Vocabulary, but the process is the same for all vocabularies in Empower. Why record a sound on a button? Access to sounds can be fun and motivating for the AAC communicator. Sounds can be a great way to get a communication partner's attention. They can add emphasis and drama to the conversation. You can record someone's voice on a button. You can import a sound file to a button. First, let's talk about recording your voice on a button. From your vocabulary, you will select Menu, and from Quick Menu, you will select Editor. Navigate to the page where you can see the button that you want to edit. Then select Edit and the button that you want to edit. Let's see what that looks like. On the Edit button screen, you'll select Action, Add Action, select Audio, and choose Play Audio. To record your voice, you'll select Record Audio. Tap the microphone icon to begin the recording countdown. Wah, wah. Select the Play wah, button wah. to listen to your recording. Use the volume slider to adjust the microphone sensitivity of the accent if your recording isn't loud enough. Select Try Again and Re-Record. Name your recorded audio file and select Finish. Make sure to select Save on this screen. Here you can see the name of your audio file. Now let's look for a symbol to represent our sound. For this example, we're not going to add a label to our button, but if you wanted to do that, you would select Message and then add the label. To choose our symbol, we're going to select Search for Symbols. Then we'll type in the name of the symbol to represent the recorded sound and select Finished. Watch as symbols auto-populate on the screen. Choose your favorite and select Finish. And remember to select Save. Wah, wah. Now we'll talk about importing a sound on a button. There are lots of different websites that offer free sound effects that you can download. First, find a sound that you want to import into a button while searching on your computer. Download the sound file to a USB drive. Insert the USB drive into the Accent device. From your vocabulary, select Menu and Editor. Navigate to the page where you can see the button that you want to edit. Select Edit and the button you want to edit. Select Actions and Add Action. Select Audio and choose Play Audio. This time select Import Audio and look for your USB drive. You may have to use the arrow to move through different options. There's my drive and I see my sound file. My file is called Crowd Laughing and I select it. I can see the name of my file listed here. Let's search for a symbol. I'm going to type the word clap because my sound is the sound of a crowd clapping and cheering. Watch as the symbols auto-populate. Choose your favorite symbol select Finished, and Save. <laughs> to learn more about our products and services, visit our website at www.printrom.com.